Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you are playing Delta Force Hawk Ops and your game keep crashing, whatever it's on start of mid match or during loading screen, this video is for you. I found a few working fix that might save your day. Let's jump right in. First off, let's quickly talk about the most common crashes error players are facing. Game completely freezing during loading screen, crash right after launching, random shutdown during multiplayer matches. Most of these are caused by system compatibility, outdated driver, or corrupted game files. Here is how to fix them step by step. So if you want to fix your game crashing problems, random shutdown problems, then follow my step one by one. This is the first solution and the main solution for your game crashing. Make sure your graphic driver are up to date. Go to NVIDIA or AMD app. You can check it here, whatever it's updated or not. This alone can fix 90% of crash problems. So always check inside your NVIDIA or AMD app. If you don't know how to update your graphic driver, then follow this video step by step and you'll update your graphic driver in no time. For the NVIDIA user, open the NVIDIA app first. Then select the driver option, which is on your left side. Then click on check for driver, which is on your right side on the top of the corner. There is a new driver, it will appear like this. If your GPU have a new available driver, click the download button and after completing the download, after download complete, click the install button. Click yes if asked to allow changes to be made, then choose the installation method. In most cases, you will want to use the express installation. Then go down and click continue button. Then wait for the driver to install. This process may take a few minutes. Your screen may flash a few times as your driver are updated. Restart your computer after installation is complete and your NVIDIA driver is up to date. For the AMD, open the AMD app. Now we are inside the AMD software. Options and menu are similar to the NVIDIA app. There is a check for update option in the AMD software also. You can click it and it will appear same as in NVIDIA and you can start installation. Again same as in NVIDIA, display may flicker one or two time during the installation process. After the installation process complete, restart your computer. Now your GPU driver is up to date, you can play it and check it. If your game crashing problem is solved, then you are good to go. If it didn't solve your problem, then you can try the second method and the second method is very short and quick you just have to run your game as an administrator to run the game in admin mode you have to open the steam first then click the delta force after that click on the gear icon on the right side choose the manage file browse local file click on game folder then get inside the delta force binary win64 folder then search for the delta force client win64 shipping file Right click on the file then left click on the run as administrator. Well this is our second solution. Try to run the game and check your game is crashing or not. If this didn't help you out we have a third solution. And our third solution is to verify the game files. To verify the game file first open the steam then go to the game library. After that choose delta force. Then right click on it. Select the properties. Then click on install files. Well, there is an option called verify integrity of game files. Double click on it. Game file verification process is starting and it will take a few times. After completing the process, you can try to play the game and you can check the game if it's crashing or not. If your game is still crashing, we have a fourth solution and the fourth solution is deleting your game config file. Lots of players are saying that it helps and it stops crashing the game. To delete the config file, First open the steam app then select the delta force after right clicking the delta force you go to the properties then click on browse double click on game folder delta force save files config then windows client then search for the game user setting and delete this file then try to run the game the file will automatically regenerated by the game engine if it is still crashing, you can try another solution and the fifth solution is disabling your in-game overlays, turning off background overlays, Steam overlay, Discord, Xbox game bar, MSA afterbar, they all can cause crashes. Try disabling them before you launch the game. If it is still not launching or crashing your game, you can try our final solution and it will 100% work most of the time so you can try it now. If it is still crashing, you can update your DirectX 12 and Visual C++ redistributable and make sure your Windows is up to date. And that's it, one of these should fix your Delta Force Hawk Ops crashing issue. If it works, hit that like button. If not, drop your exact error in the comment. I reply fast and try to fix your problem. Subscribe for more game fix and tips guys.